Hey guys, so I'm gonna be showing you how to use Export 360 to hack your gamer score on Xbox Live. Yes, this can get you banned, but at the same time, it may not. But if you do get banned, they will most likely reset your gamer score to zero, and that's it. But first of all, you're gonna need a data migration kit, and in case you don't know what those are, it's one of these. You call Microsoft up, be like, yo, I got a 120 gigabyte hard drive. You know, I'd like to transfer all my stuff, and then they will send you this. Um, once you get it, you're going to need Export 360, which is this program right here. I know a lot of you use Explore 360. Didn't like that program, didn't tell me what, what ought to click. But you want to open Explore 360. And you need to have your hard drive connected with that with the data migration kit, USB to the hard drive. So you want to open Export 360, expand this, then go to Partition 3, Content. Now this may take a second to load, depending on how much megabytes your hard drive, well, depending how much is on your hard drive. After it loads up, the default user profile is 0000. Now it's usually this folder right here, but somehow Peggle got a hold of it. And once you would go into it, you would go to A400 and then click one of the other ones. But that's not what I'm going to be doing. Mine is messed up. I had to totally figure it out a different way. So what you have to do is you have to expand, expand E00570. Then you need to go to this one, FF071. Now, that was the same exact file in here, right? It's just in a different folder. And once you click that, you go to 01000. My bad, not 4. You click that, then you drag this to your desktop. I apologize for the dog barking in the back if, if any of you heard it. Now, you want to go back into your folder with mod tools and then go to Xbox 360 Profile Tool. I will try to put these in the description. This may take a second to load, depending how much RAM you have. Okay. Now, once this loads up, I'll show you how to do it. it I guess it's going super slow because of this, so I'm just going to go pause the screen recorder. Okay, it popped up right after I paused it, so it's kind of weird. Okay, once it's open, you want to click this X right here, and click open. And then navigate to where you stored it. So I put mine on the desktop. It is E E O five seventy eight three one B O B O. You'd click open, and then once that would load up, you would see all the games that you've played. Now, as you can see, I've already done all this, and I have one thousand gamer score, and all that. But it may not unlock every single achievement. It may just leave out one, which I have no problem with. It looks more realistic. But after you would do that, you would you would click unlock all, and then. Once you did that, you would click OK, then click Save Package. And then once it's saved, let's do that one more time. You could exit out of this, go back into your mod tools, then go to Xbox 360 Hash Block Calculator. OK, this is the most vital part, input, uh, vital instruction. If you mess up on this and it says your gamer tag has been corrupted, don't worry about it. You can just straight up recover the gamer tag and it will work. Now, you need to open that file. Then you would go to Tools, Calculate Hash Box. And what till it said done right there. Okay, you are done. Now, you would open the export again and drag this file into here. I'm not going to do it though because simply I've already done it. So this is the tutorial guys on how you're supposed to do it. Thank you for watching. I really appreciate it. It really helps. Um, just keep watching. Expect more videos like this. Next video, Avatar Unlocker. Yeah, I'm going to start doing these videos. Then after Avatar Unlocker, possibly how to use game saves. But talk to you guys later.